Hey YouTube, it's your boy Dreaming back with another what if. And in today's what if is what if Borto went back in time? Roll the intro. So let's get into the <clears throat> so let's get into the what if now. Borto would be in Nar. This this would be taking place after the Ishiki fight, like a couple couple days after. So Borto would be in Naruto's office looking for a new jutsu, because of the fact that he felt so help helpless. <clears throat> he felt so helpless in that fight, and would be in Naruto's office when well, Naruto's not looking. Well, when Naruto's not in there, looking for a new jutsu. Well, he would come across a scroll. With, he knows, because Bort, Borto knows at least a little bit about seals. Would obviously know that um, this is this requires a blood seal. And would try to use his blood to see if it will work. This is when it would explode. And Borto will be engulfed in a white light. As Boruto will wake up in the office of, of the Hokage again, he scratches his head and says, Oh, my head hurts so much. As Boruto notices the umbrella all around him, he says, Why are you wearing that outdated gear? <clears throat> As Houston says, So, you finally woke up. As Boruto will say, Who said that? That is at you. It don't sound like him, but you know, you never know. He was and said, I'm definitely not your dad. <clears throat> and Boruto says, Lord Third, aren't you dead? As this user says, um, I'm very much alive. Who gave you this news? Um You've been dead for at least what, twenty two years? Twenty years, tw twenty to twenty two years? He was him say, "Wow, hmm, I wouldn't know if I've been dead for twenty to twenty-two years. Where do you think I'm dead? Um, because my dad's the Okage. You're dead. A lot of things have happened. I, I don't. What what year is this? I don't know what year Boruto takes. Naruto takes place in. So he was him. We gave him the years. Boruto says, "Oh crap." I'm in the wrong time. There's no way back. As he would dismiss his Ambu immediately, saying, Say that again, what are you talking about the wrong time? Boruto will basically go on to explain that in his time, Naruto's his dad and he's the, Naruto's the Hokage. To which he would ask him, How does he know that he's not lying about this? To which Boruto will say, you really think I'd be lying about this? I'm stuck in the past, old man. I have not a clue what to do. <clears throat> so Hiruzen would say, well, you know, you never know. You could be lying for all I know. Boruto says, oh, man, I, I really hate old people. He says, hey, I'm not that old. I am still the whole Kage. Yeah. Yeah, so you're Naruto, son, huh? Yeah, so you would, yeah, so you wouldn't mind if I, you know, did a DNA test to, to see if you're lying or not. No, I wouldn't mind. So he was in would have one of his on blue retrieved Naruto, introduced Naruto to Boruto, and they would, and he was in just in case Boruto is actually telling the truth, would tell Naruto that this is his cousin who recently came to the Hidden Leaf to to stay with him, to join him in the academy. <clears throat> to which Borto would give Hughes in that weird look like, did you just volunteer me for the academy? So Hughes in would say that he's only here to make sure that he's actually who he says he says he is. His Naruto says, well, he looks like me. But you know, you can never be too sure. To which he allows Hughes in to, um, 
you know, get some DNA sample for him to do the DNA test. So, no, Houston would, um, later on, Houston would confirm that Borto is Naruto, um, uh, related to Naruto. And so he would tell Naruto, but he wouldn't tell, he would confirm that Borto's actually Naruto's son, but he wouldn't tell Naruto that it's his son. He would just say that he actually is his cousin. They would tell Naruto that he'll be joining him next week at the academy while he gets something prepared for him. A place to stay. To which Borto says, why don't I stay with Naruto? As Houston says, well, Naruto's house isn't that well isn't suited for two people well then why not find a place for two people I'm cool with letting Naruto stay with me this is fine but go with Naruto for now be back in a week and I have everything prepared which is cool hey Naruto you want to go train because Naruto would not uh, would not have said yes so <clears throat> He was in during the time skip to the end of the week. Borto, now in train. Okay, no, no. Borto would have taught Naruto some things. Now these are the things that Borto has taught Naruto. His chakra nature, but he will find his chakra nature, which in this one it will come with a significant change. But Naruto would have wind, lightning, and water to you know complement Borto because Borto has that exact thing. <clears throat> Just for. Just for something. It's just a change. Minor change. For convenience. And he would also teach Naruto the shadow, the multi-shadow clone jutsu. Well, the shadow clone jutsu and the multi-version. <clears throat> to which Naruto would obviously get that. He got, Naruto got it done, what, in within two hours? Two to three hours? So, yeah, he would definitely get this all done within a week. So, by the end of the week, you know, they, they was, um, Boruto would, Tell Naruto that he, they're gonna start him some Taijutsu training, cause obviously his Taijutsu is horrible from what the academy teachers are teaching him. <clears throat> so Naruto would accept, it, which is why we're gonna go to Hiruzen. Hiruzen would have gotten an apartment and would have told Boruto and Naruto that they can move in by the end of the month. All the um is pre prepared and everything, that they both have an um a monthly allowance. <clears throat> So, you know, Boruto would join Naruto in school, wearing his, um, board, um, what he wore in the academy. He would, he was in with, um, and he was in would notice that Boruto would also have noticed that Boruto's headband is that of a rogue ninja. Because he's wearing Sasuke's at the time. He was wearing Sasuke's at the time because he never really gave it back to Sasuke. He hadn't given it to Sasuke yet. <clears throat> Let's see. Now, Borto would immediately have, in the academy, Borto would have immediately noticed that most of the teachers, except for Iruka, are uh, trying, well, after finding out that Borto was Naruto's cousin, they would immediately be trying to sabotage his grades, and he noticed that they're trying to sabotage Naruto. But, you know, Borto would have taken that into his control. Which is why we're going to time skip to a year, to the next year, to the next start of the academy. Now, Borto and Naruto has already moved into their apartment and everything. And in that year, Borto has taught Naruto some of his jutsu. He taught him the Rasengan, um, Gel Palm, <clears throat> along with um, Lightning and Water. He has a Lightning and Water release. He can use those too. So, Thunderclap Arrow and um, Surging Sea. Water Salve Surging Sea. These are the basic jutsu Borto taught, him. and he um he's teaching Naruto the how you get um fighting style or his fighting style basically. But you know, yeah, I'm gonna say Borto's a little bit unpredictable, unpredictable like Naruto. Nah, Naruto's more of a known prodigy, but yeah, Naruto will basically take on Borto's fighting style. <clears throat> so when they would come back, Borto and Naruto will be sporting new clothes. Boruto would be sporting Sasuke's cloak along with a sword that's exactly like Sasuke's. <clears throat> Naruto would be sporting his Shippuden clothes with the Sage Mode cloak. And hair like Minato. Because in that year, Boruto and Naruto made a bet. That bet was, if Naruto can get the Rasengan down within a month, with one hand, not mind you, with one hand using the Shadow Clone method, 
Boruto would tell him about his parents, which Naruto, you know, <clears throat> trying to find out who his parents is, that takes priority over everything, would have um, got it down within three weeks. So this is why we went, uh, so this is basically what's all happened. So yes. <clears throat> so when Iruka would come in, um, he would notice that Naruto looks a little bit like the um, Hokage, the young Nami, uh, the fourth Hokage. So as he would wonder, <clears throat> why did Naruto change his hair to look like that? Boruto's is much the same. It's not really long at all. So, <clears throat> Boruto and Naruto would immediately, uh, while, when they walk in, well, I, yeah, when they walk in, Boruto and Naruto would immediately be um, yelled at by Sasuke's fan girls for trying to look cool. As Boruto and Naruto um, scoff and then go to the back of the back of the class to see what Shikamaru Choji, yeah, Shikamaru Choji. <clears throat> so, so um, in that so, Naruto, we're gonna have we're gonna basically time skip again. We're gonna talk after about time skip because in this video I have to get through a lot of things. Boruto and Naruto would be on the graduation exam. And in this past two years, Boruto has been in the top with Naruto in third place and Sasuke in second in the first year that Boruto was there. In the second year, Naruto was in second and Boruto was in third. <clears throat> so here comes the graduation exams. Boruto would obviously pass due to him knowing the Shadow Clone due to transformation in the replacement. <clears throat> Naruto would pass two due to him knowing well basically the same thing in the shadow clone due to the replacement due to well the um the substitution due to I don't know how I do I call it the replacement. I heard that somewhere. Anyways, the replacement due to and the transformation due to man, that was a lot to over. No. <clears throat> they would immediately, you know, grad um not grad they would get their headbands. Due to them knowing the Shadow Clone Jutsu, but they would still have to participate in everything else. But, you know, the Shadow Clone Jutsu is kind of what was needed for them to... The, them knowing the three Jutsu is kind of what's needed for them to pass. <clears throat> so in the final circle, it would be Sasuke versus some random background character where Sasuke would obviously win. And then it will be Naruto versus Boruto. <clears throat> so... When this would happen, Boruto would have had, um, how do I say this? Boruto would have not mopped the floor with Naruto, but he would have beaten him with at least medium difficulty. Because Naruto is still in the process of learning and everything. Naruto has at least, what, like two to three months left before he, you know, he's, um, he'll be on par with Boruto. And that's with the Karma Seal. Without it, Naruto is pretty much the past Boruto. So, but yeah, Boruto would beat Naruto with mid difficulty, and we and this is where we will go on to the Shuriken and Kunai throwing. Boruto would get a ten out of ten alone, and Naruto would get a nine out of ten. Well, nine and a half. Now, <clears throat> Naruto actually had points reduced due to for slightly passing the line. Slight because he wasn't paying attention. So he did hit all 10 targets but got points reduced for slightly pressing the line. And then we're going to... Uh, Sasuke... Well, we don't really care. Boruto and Naruto um, don't really care what Sasuke thinks at the moment. Because Boruto... And, well, after meeting Sasuke and being beaten by Sasuke and showing Jutsu that Sasuke doesn't even know, Sasuke would have immediately went up to Boruto and demanded those Jutsus from him. Telling that he's a new Chia, he deserves those to kill someone. And so Boruto would immediately hate this Sasuke, but would still, you know, adore the future Sasuke. So, yeah, basically this is what that's what's happening with Boruto and Naruto and Sasuke. So Sasuke would pass with a nine out of ten. You know, still bad because now Naruto is another person who's stronger than him. Because the, the speed that both Boruto and Naruto are moving at was at least tuning level speed. <clears throat> so, 
They were going to the Renaissance Zone, which Boruto was scored um, 100, but Naruto was scoring at 85 out of 100. Because Naruto, learning still does not come easy to Naruto, even with Boruto. Even after Boruto told, but Naruto really only improved and everything because Boruto did tell him that he had a clan to represent, the Uzumaki clan. Along with, if, until his father, until, you know, he was strong enough, he would, um, he was still, he would still have to be strong enough to represent his father. And we show, and we show something that can surpass his own father. <clears throat> so this is what Naruto would be working, uh, would have, uh, been, you know, pushing himself so hard to, you know, Master Dora Sengon and everything. <clears throat> so, Ruka will pass. Er, almost everyone, everybody who will pass in canon will pass now, but Boruto will also be included. <clears throat> so, we're going to time skip to the next day. Ruka will call almost all the teams, but he will get to Team 7. Well, except for, you know, Team 8 and Team 10. He will call Team 7. Boruto Uzumaki. Naruto Uzumaki. Sakura Haruno and Sasuke Uchiha. Everyone is wondering why is their team a four man team? Here's Boruto is also confused about. Which is when the Hokage, um, which is when um, Iruku will say that the Hokage cho chose to make this the first five man team. I, I know I said four man, but it's a five man team technically. Because then they won't even have his Jonin Sensei. So Naruto and Boruto will bump fist, and um, Iruka will call the rest of the um, teams. <clears throat> so Boruto and Naruto would um, um Boruto and Naruto, you know, would sit down and start point um, start talking in Naruto's mind skip with the Kaiyubi. something that Naruto actually just recently learned from Boruto, something that he could do. So and yeah, because Boruto did tell Naruto about the Kaiyubi. And will tell Naruto that he, if there's any friends he really needs, it's the Kaiyubi. See, that's how they're going to be real close. They've all, they've always been, Kaiyubi's always been in Naruto's life. Naruto just never knew it. So, and <clears throat> the Kaiyubi takes a more liking to Boruto than to Naruto. Because Boruto constantly calls the Kaiyubi awesome and everything. But, you know, there was one it's in, in <laughs> incident when Boruto called the Kaiyubi short because it was shorter than what he than what it was in the future because it was the half of Kaiyubi instead of a full Kaiyubi. Basically, yeah. So, <clears throat> yeah. so Naruto would basically be able to um, talk to the Kaiyubi and would be able to access one tail's worth one and working on two tails worth of chakra. <clears throat> uh. And due to him being able to access one tail, one to two, almost two tails worth of chakra, you know, his, his um, Naruto would kind of. Mm, I really wouldn't know. I really want Naruto to kind of story, but then he kind of like, isn't that kind of what he did with the case here? He would store it separately from the Kaiyubi. Thing. So yeah, no, and Boruto doesn't really have the seal to the key, um the key to the, the key to the seal. Yeah, I was gonna say the seal to the key. <clears throat> so we will get into the getting exams. Not the exam. Fuck. I just we just did this. We will get into um Naruto and you know, meeting Kakashi, which both um Boruto would um add a water bottle on top of um a, not a water bottle, a water bucket. On top of the thing, so when Kakashi is here with the eraser, he would bend, pick the eraser up. <clears throat> I mean, he would um, no, um, the eraser would fall to the ground. To his Naruto would yank a um a string that's tied to the eraser, pulling the water bucket, basically hitting Kakashi um dos dosing water on Kakashi, dousing Kakashi in water, and then Kakashi gets hit on the head with the bucket. Kakashi would have actually laughed at this and said that, that was a pretty um, pretty unique prank scene to, and um, a weird but um, small prank scene to what Naruto's major scale pranks that he normally pulls. So they will basically go up to the roof after Kakashi would tell them to, and would do the, <clears throat> um, and would do the introductions, 
And Bortel says that he hopes to save the future and to save the world from his future threats. And Naruto says he hopes to become Okage and to help Boruto achieve his dreams. Sasuke would say his basic emo stuff, and, and Sakura would say his fangirl stuff, except she would say, I don't like Naruto or Boruto. Kikashi would say, hmm, fangirl. Definitely did not ask for that. Man, I'm gonna hate it. <clears throat> so. But tell me, you guys, are y'all fucking with the thumbnail? I really want to know. Y'all give it the thumbnail. Because the thumbnail could be better. It really could be. But, you know. But, you know. <clears throat> it's not as good as I want it to be. So, like, I've seen top tier where if YouTubers have these fire thumbnails. And I try to recreate it as best as I can. Or try to create mine as best as I can. Just, you know, to be fire like theirs. But, you know, you do with what you got. I make most of my thumbnails on my phone, actually. So, my one. Oh well, let's get in back into the work. <clears throat> anyway, Kashi would go on to tell the team, um, Tell the team to come tomorrow and not to eat. To which Boruto would already know what test it is. Because his father told him about certain things. Like how he, you know, befriended the Kayubi. How he got, how he ended up, you know, getting Kayubi mode. You know, who his father was and everything. Who his mother was. And the bell test that Kakashi did have them do. The test that Kakashi had them do to become Ginyan. Or to become official Ginyan and, and everything. So when they went back home, Boruto would t immediately tell Naruto that the thing is about teamwork. And it's something that he's heard that Kakashi does a lot. He re really preaches teamwork. So obviously they will pass. Boruto would, uh, Naruto would know that they, they're they going to pass. So the next day, Naruto would pretty much act like an idiot. Boruto using this as a, um, and use this as a distraction. Of Naruto acting like an idiot, like he did in Kenny. Except with better, um, better clothes. Anyways, Boruto would um hit Kakashi with a um surging sea, um watch out surging sea, as Naruto would then poof into smoke as <clears throat> on the water, as Naruto the real Naruto lands on the on um, water as Kakashi says, huh? As Naruto does the hand sizes, he says thunderclap arrow, as he slaps his hands onto the water surface. As the lightning begins to surge from the, um, as lightning begins to surge on the water surface, electric human Kakashi. To which then both Naruto, um, to which then Naruto and Boruto would do the hand signs. As Boruto and Naruto would then make a shadow clone. This, this is basically the hand signs for a shadow clone. Because I'm pretty sure there are hand signs and there are different ones. I've seen something like that. Anyways, Boruto and then we'll make a shadow clone, and the clones would, and along with the other clone, would do a hand sign. As Boruto and, then, and both Naruto would use um the basically Boruto's version of the Boruto uh, the Boruto stream. And both grabbing three all three bells. Now there's three bells due to Kakashi having four members. So yeah, it's three bells. And when this is done. Boruto will toss his bell, the two bells he got to Nar not to Naruto, to Sakura and Sasuke, and Naruto will toss his bell to Boruto. So Boruto will say, no, why don't you take it? Naruto says, I would rather have my team um, stay as ninjas than go back. Sasuke and Sakura would agree with this, and would, they would basically play hot potato. So Kakashi gets tired of it and says, you all pass. Which is where we're going to have a three-month time, not three-year, three-month time skip of them doing missions. Which is why we'll be eating the ending the what if off here. I hope you guys have a good time. Peace and goodbye.